Steam Sundays, championed by your Southern California Toyota dealers. Well, this morning we begin a new series called Steam Sundays. In this series, you'll meet local men and women who have dream come true careers because of their training in science, technology, engineering, art, or mathematics. Yes, that of course is also known <laughs> as STEAM, but you might be wondering what a STEAM education has to do with Rose Parade floats. Yeah. I was wondering, so I went to visit a <laughs> float factory in Irwindale just to find that out. There's fire and wires and flowers, and grit. A wonderland of imagination and ingenuity. A perfect stop for the Toyota Mobile Weather Lab. Hey, Craig, welcome to Fiesta Prey Float. Glad you could make it today. Tim Estes is living his dream, working 80 hours a week as president of Fiesta Parade Floats in Irwindale. We're actually already under construction here on floats for the 2019 Rose Parade. His interest in float building started in childhood. But I was really fascinated by the building of the floats and making these big giant monsters. Tim's challenge, take ideas and shepherd them through the painstaking process it takes to make them become a show-stopping reality. It just takes a lot of discipline, so a lot of common sense, and, and, and just good education. Tim started off at age eight gluing flowers on floats. Since then, he's done just about every job it takes to bring a float to fruition. You kind of look at the marvel of how things have been created throughout the world and, and all that comes down to mathematics. This dig alert float was last year's winner for best use of animation. It started out as an idea, then became a picture. From there, Tim and his team turned it into a model. I made this crane actually move back and forth. Once the model's approved, the engineering comes into play. I'll turn around and figure out how to make this whole thing pivot. But for that to work, the numbers and the measurements need to be spot on. If I'm just off an eighth of an inch, you know, something's not going to work right. Math has been really, really important for everything I do. I do the engineering. I drop my own contracts. I do all my own accounts payable. Every day brings new projects and new challenges. These dolphins, they're headed for SeaWorld. This chassis, it needs to be taken apart and rebuilt for a float for next year's parade. And this model of the City of Torrance's 2019 Rose Parade float, it's in the process of being built to full scale. So that Tim and his crew can start work on their next spectacular creation. This bear is fishing. In a float factory like this, the work is hard and the days are long. But just look at what all that math engineering and artistry can become. So no surprise, Tim never gets tired of working in his workshop of wonders. What I love most about this industry is the creativity and doing something different every year. So much fun to visit and among the job titles at Fiesta Parade Floats, engineer, model maker, float designer and floral designer. Tim has done just about every job in the shop, and he says the mo that most of the people who work with him, they are all specialists. They really are. Yeah, yeah. that's amazing, Craig. Mm -hmm. You know, we see those floats every year at the Rose Parade, and we just admire their beauty. Right. I think we forget how much math and exactly. all that goes yeah. into it. And it, it's, it's great when you think about it, because when I was a kid, I wasn't thinking, I can use this math to do these cool things, like right. build a float. You're out right. in, the, uh, in the factory, or in the in the you know, in the, this big mm -hmm. warehouse, and they've got a grids, grids everywhere on mm -hmm. the on the floor because they need to make precise measurements right. so that everything goes on there and Perfectly. it fits exactly. And it spins and moves the way it's supposed to. Right, yeah. and you have different people working on different parts, so when they bring it all together, it right. all has to mesh. Cohesive, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And if you have never seen one of those oh floats gosh. close oh, up, you've gosh. got to come and check them out someday yes. because yeah. the little seeds and flowers up yes. close. It's just amazing right. to see what they use. The one we saw there was the Big Bear. It looks really it looks exciting. Really cool. I'm excited about yeah. the, the parade and yeah. you know, it's just, it's, it's really magical to watch. And we've got some really